Do you see yourself as God sees you or the way others see you? I'm Marcia Greenwood, and this is Windows on the Word. Unless we learn to look at ourselves like God looks at us, we'll never reach the potential that He has for us. You know that the devil bombards our minds and he comes against us in every way and tries to condemn us and make us say bad things about ourselves. But we need to realize that we're a child of God and dearly loved by him. Our mental pictures of ourselves should be changed not according to some worldly view, but changed into the image of how God sees us. Quit criticizing what God has created. Every time we do that, it's like we're turning our backs on what God thinks of us. We need to realize that when we were born again, we became a new creature in Christ Jesus. Old things passed away, and behold, all things have become new. There are beautiful descriptions in the Bible about how God sees us. Well, I don't see myself that way, you may say. So, change your mind. The Bible says we're to transform our minds with the washing of the water of the Word. We must continue to immerse ourselves in the Word of God until our minds are renewed and we begin to think and speak and act just like God. What if Jesus didn't feel like he measured up to what God had for him? He just felt too unworthy to take on the sins of the whole wide world. Wow, where would we be now? You see, God can never be wrong. Learn to agree with God. We don't know everything, but God does. He sees the past, present, and our future. He thought of you before the foundation of the world. God says that you're his workmanship. You are the clay in the potter's hands. Let him work with you and continue to mold and shape your life. He knows the plans that he has for you. We must get excited with his way of thinking about us so we can fulfill his plans for our lives. If you were working on a project, putting something together, and things weren't going too well, you would look into the manual and change the way you were doing things to the way the manual said to do things so your project will succeed, right? So we need to learn to confess God's word. That is, we need to learn to believe what God says just because he says it. It's not arrogance to say what God says. What do you say about yourself? I'll never amount to anything. I'm just not as smart as so-and-so. We've always been poor. My marriage is going to end up in divorce. I'm never going to get a better paying job. Stop putting down what God has lifted up. Instead, say, I can do all things through Christ Jesus. My marriage is getting better every day. Oh, my child is so smart. You see, when we read the Bible, we need to believe what it says. When you say, I'm a failure, then you allow failure to work in your life. When you say, I'll never be able to pay these bills and catch up, much less get out of debt, well, guess what? You won't. When you say these things, you're walking into the snare laid by the devil, and you placed yourself there by your own words. When you say, I'm blessed, then blessings will come into your life. God says that if he is for us, then who can be against us? Well, it's time we learn to get on God's side. Now, people may reject you, but I have accepted you, God says. Your spirit man has been washed in the blood of Jesus, and you've been made the righteousness of God inside of you. God has made you a worthy new creature. God never makes failures. You may not feel worthy, but God says you are worthy. You're worthy to receive all that I have given you. It's not about our feelings. It's about our faith. So when we live by faith, we please God. You are worthy because Jesus shed his blood to make you worthy. 
please don't take the blood of Jesus lightly. So I want to encourage you from this time forward, no more looking back, begin looking at yourself through the eyes of God and be blessed. I want to thank you for joining us and watching this video. We can stay connected when you subscribe. You can be notified whenever the next Windows on the Word video is released. So click on the subscribe link, click on the like button, and click the notify bell here on the screen. And please share this video with others. Succeeding at Being Yourself is also available on CD, audio, and MP3 download from our online product catalog at W www.tgm.org Be blessed because God loves you.